Hello and welcome everybody. Devin with 605 Sports Cards here. Picked up a few of these little variety pack tins from Walmart. So we got a 2022 Prism pack, 2022 Optic pack, a 2021 Optic pack, and then the uh, select draft picks for 2022. So a few, a few good retail packs in there with the uh, select draft picks being the bottom tier of it um the tens are cool so i know people are kind of getting them just for those they make good storage especially for like maybe some of your pc cards you know throw them in there uh good variety for a lot of teams just kind of grab these three to get a little variety picks um i'm not expecting a ton out of these i think they're just retail packs and obviously downtown would be the the big big surprise out of one of those optic packs but only two total packs and they're always from different seasons so still left in there pretty good there we go um at 25 bucks a 10 kind of pricey for the four packs i mean you are getting a few good ones i think you get five or six packs in a optic so and they're 30-ish, so not the best value, but the tins are cool. So I figured to get a couple just to just to have the tins and uh, see if we can get lucky here with pulling something out of one of these packs. So we'll do the optic 2021 last, 2022 second. We'll start with the select draft picks for 2022. Yeah, the one Walmart closer to the house doesn't have cards, but the one on the other side of town did have the card section. So we got Carson Strong, who's no longer in the NFL, I don't believe. There's a TJ Watt, Eli Manning. Our laser is Travis Kelsey with an Isaiah Spiller rookie card. So what do you expect out of a draft pitch? Let's see if we can find some color in the prism here. Waddle base. Parker. It's like all base pack. There's a Prescott. And uh, a Joe Bo. So we did pull a DAC out of the DAC bin. Alright, 2022 optic. Uh, some lasers in this would be insane for that. Looks like we might have a stars in the back. So, so we're looking for those retail packs. Sneed, Romo, and it is not a rookie. It is Corey Davis on the stars. So not bad to get out of a you know one optic pack. You do get the star insert. So finally the kickoff week here for NFL. Already had one upset with the Lions taking down the Chiefs, which they were short Kelsey and Jones. Very good game to watch. And ETN on Elite Series rookies with got some damage right there. Kind of a bummer. That does it for the first 10. And also, everyone getting to start their fantasy week now. I only had the kicker for the Chiefs, so it wasn't too bad for that first week. Got a couple field goals, at least. And a bummer for everyone that drafted Kelsey early, being out the first game. Injury doesn't really go keep him out the whole season. So plenty of time to bounce back. All right, here we go. 10 number two with Herbert. Let's see if he can bring the magic. Again, same packs.
It is fun to get open up some 2021 in here. So there's a Pickett rookie. A Jordan Davis rookie. It's a nice Pickett. And a Russell Wilson for our stars. Some nice looking cards there for the laser. So nice card. See if he can uh, turn this year around. Had a tough go of it in a Brady. New coach. Got him some weapons over there. Marvin Mims could potentially have a good year with them. Another base pack with a Matthew Stafford Brilliance insert. Nothing too exciting. Probably real low chance getting big hits out of here. Just being one optic pack for, for each year. Or one prism without having the whole box. And looks like we got a base pack here and Jordan Davis rookie. Alright. 2021 prison. Be cool to get that stars insert for one of the main quarterbacks. And it looks like we just got a rookie on the back. Earl Campbell, Miles Gaskin, and Patrick Sertain is the rookie. Alright, saving Brady here for last. Even without the, the big hits, the tens are cool on their own. Sort them back out. I imagine you can probably pull autographs out of this. I think these are the blaster box packs. Oh, the other ones are just the retail boxes. Alright, Justin Jefferson, a Drake London rookie. Let's see if we hit a rookie on our laser. We do, and it is Jordan Davis. So one laser parallel there for the rookie. So we'll go with 2022 optic first, say the prism for second here. Our third pack. Might have a stars in the back again. Derek Brown. Jonathan Allen. Not a rookie. Kair Elam. Stars insert. So not bad getting two star inserts. It is a rookie. So not too shabby. Get two star inserts out of a few tens there. Dump the piles over. All right, let's get to Prism for 2022. And just a base pack, so I'm not gonna be much in there. Jerry Judy and Pierre Strong is our rookie. All right. Final pack of the rip. Um, let me know if you guys opened up any of these tins. Like I said, they're kind of cool just to have some of the tins for storage or maybe you find your, your team so you can throw up their tins decoration. Um, be sure to like and subscribe to the channel. Helps me out a lot. And we'll keep some more content coming here as things keep releasing. Patrick Queen, Devontae Adams, and a... Rondale Moore, who they're expecting to be a little more of a contributor this year. Let's see what happens with Kyler Murray. Don't sound like he may be starting this week. But really, I'd say our two, two biggest cards would be these stars inserts. I didn't expect anything huge out of these. I should have me get lucky and hit it downtown, but chances are slim to none in a regular blaster boxes so just out of one retail pack per thing pretty tough to do but fun tins you know they look nice with kind of like the little color blast in the back so 
little pricey at $25. Uh, probably won't pick up really anymore, but just wanted a few of the tens to, to have. So that'll do it for this video. We'll see you guys on the next one. And uh, good luck with your NFL fantasy teams this week.